Hello, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to set up membership on Payhip. Payhip is a platform that will allow you to sell membership online for completely free. All you'll need to do is go onto payhip.com and from there you'll be able to create an account using your email address. Once you have created your account, you'll be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Once on this dashboard, I want you to tap on products from the top navigation bar. After selecting products, you are going to tap on add new product. Then from there, you can see that you can sell digital products, courses, membership, physical product, and also coaching service. But for this example, we are going to tap on membership. After selecting membership, you can give your membership a title. So for example, I'll just call it test, then I'll tap on add membership. After you have done that, from here, you can see the different settings option on the navigation bar right here. So you can tap on pages. After you have tapped on pages, from here, you'll be able to view your sales page. So you'll be able to edit the sales page by tapping on edit. After you have tapped on edit, you'll be redirected to the editor page. So at the moment, this is how our sales page looks, as you can see right here. Now to start editing, it is quite easy. All you'll need to do is go over to the left hand menu option. From here, you can tap on header and you could change the header section. So you could change the store logo if you want. You could upload a store logo and you can also change the store title. Now when we go back, from here, we can also edit the membership title right here. You could tap on membership title and from there you could change it. So for example, if I were to type in test, you can see that it changes right there. You can also change the description and you could scroll down and you could add a button text here if you want. And then you could add a button link if you want. You can also change the background if you would like also. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on save changes. Then we'll simply go back. Once there, from here, you can change the example text, which is this section. You can edit that section if you want. So that is basically how you'll be able to edit this page. Once you're finished editing the page, you're going to simply tap where you see membership page in the top left hand corner and you can continue editing. So for example, you could edit the contact page. You can edit all pages on your website. And from there, you can tap on publish once you are finished. So we'll simply tap on publish. Then we're going to tap on continue editing. So let me do that real quick. Then I'm going to close out. So I'll exit it by tapping on the three dashes in the top left hand corner. After you have done that, you can view the checkout page. You can also view and edit the thank you page. Now that you have edited all pages from here, you can tap on pricing and you'll be able to set your pricing. So you can tap on add pricing plan. And this is where you'll be able to either set up a one-time purchase or you can create a subscription plan. Or if you don't want to create a subscription plan, you can set up a payment plan or you can offer it for free as you can see right here. So you can select whichever one of these options you would like to use. After setting up your pricing plan, I recommend that you tap on posts from the top navigation bar. Then you're going to tap on manage posts. After you have selected manage posts, you're going to tap on create new posts. From here, you have a few options. You can either create a text post, you can upload video, or you could upload image and you can also create a poll or you could embed your course if you have created it on another platform. So let's say if I were to tap on video. After selecting video, you would give it a title right there and then you can choose whether you like to embed a YouTube or a Vimeo video or a video hosted by Payhip or simply an embed code. Then you can put in the video code right here after you have done that, you can add in the content that you would like to appear below the video. Then you can quickly upload an attachment if you want. After you have done that, you could tap on publish. So that's how you will be able to publish different stuff that your members will be able to see. 
after you have done that to view all your members you could tap on members from the top navigation bar and from here you will also be able to see quizzes and remember that you will be able to create quizzes in the same section just like what i showed you earlier you can also create surveys and you will also be able to view the assignments that you have given them and if we were to go back a bit you can also tap on video library from the top navigation bar and from here you have a few options if it is a case that you would like to create a video library so a video course you could tap on upload right here then from here you could tap on pay hip videos and you could sign up another option that you also have is video subscription if you were to tap on that you will be able to sell video subscription as you can see right here so you don't need to sign up for video subscription with payhip to use videos on your course or membership instead of adding a video type lesson you can add embedded type lessons if you want but if it is a case that you would like to use the video subscription you can tap on continue and you can set it up and that's basically it once you are finished setting up your course and it is to your liking, you are going to tap on publish and it will now be live. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.